This beautiful looking coffee machine is the Regenta 5 bar coffee machine. So what does 5 bar mean? 5 bar means 5 times atmospheric pressure. We have a brew machine which is just based on gravity, very light coffee. Then you have the 15 or 20 bar machines which give the thick espresso shot. But a lot of people like the lighter espresso which comes out from the 5 bar machine. It's very reasonably priced also so a lot of people prefer it because of that. Uh, how does this operate? So first we fill in the water and we tighten the slit properly. Now all the pressure is controlled by this lid, so make sure you tighten it very well and do not open it while the machine is in operation till the time the pressure is completely released. Please don't open this during the operation of the machine or while there is still some steam inside. Now here, first we switch on the machine by turning the knob to the right so we can take out the espresso shot. Let the water get heated up, it will take about a minute or so. At the bottom, down below, we have this beautiful carafe, toughened glass, nice handle and a lid which you can pick up from your thumb like this. And there is a hole here which you use to insert the cup like this. So first we remove this and we will add some coffee in the pota filter. Now you see this is a deep filter because we are not taking out 15 or 30 ml of espresso shot. We are in fact taking out a full jug of coffee. We are taking out a full carafe of coffee. We get this spool and the tamper with the machine. So we will fill up finely ground coffee. Medium ground, not so fine as the 15 bar espresso, but more finely ground than the brew machine. Tamp it like this. Remove the extra coffee with your finger like this. So the top is very clear. Then we insert the put a filter like this and we keep our carafe. Now we keep it in pause the machine will keep getting heated up and then whenever you want you can take out the shot. So let's put it in the espresso mode so directly when ready the coffee will start flowing out. So let's see how you can hear the sound of water boiling it's a very powerful thermo block inside immediately the water starts boiling steam is getting built up inside creating the pressure and once it reaches 5 bar we will see the espresso shot flowing out. It has taken about 2 minutes and now we can see the coffee flowing out. You can see here the coffee is flowing out. You can see dripping and nice rich black aromatic espresso is flowing out of the machine. So we can see the coffee shot has come out and now we can turn the knob to steam. So we can see now the coffee has come out. We will put it in pause for a while. And once it stops dripping, we will take off the cup like this. Look at this fantastic, rich, aromatic coffee is ready. I love to have it just like this without adding any milk or sugar. But we can make cappuccino out of it. Let us see how. Some coffee may drip on the cleaning tray, but don't worry. It's so easy to take it out and you can throw away the few drops of coffee which are there and just place the tray back again. Now let us create some nice cappuccino. Let us steam some milk. For that we turn the dial anti-clockwise to steam. See the wonderful steaming. There was little milk and it has filled the entire jar. First as always we will clean the spout very very important to clean the spout immediately and how do we do that we clean it on the top then we release some steam so it is clean from inside good baristas do that first first clean the spout and then pour your cappuccino now the milk is nicely frothed and we will use it to make our cappuccino and look at this nice froth wonderful crema and an awesome cappuccino is ready.